Assalamualaikum. Good afternoon everyone. Hello Wan Ruby. How are you today? Today we are going to continue our lesson on the addition and subtraction story. For now, for today, you are going to do the problem solving. Means you need to solve the problem or the story given. Problem solving means penyelesaian masalah. Okay, for today's lesson, the book that you need is activity book part 1. So, now we want to solve the problem from page 111 until 114. Don't worry because teacher will guide you one by one question. Okay, are you ready girls? Okay, good. We look at the first question. Hamidi collects 23 Malaysia and 9 Singapore stamps. How many stamps altogether? Okay, can't you find the word altogether? Apa maksud altogether? Ah, kesemuanya. Okay, bila ada perkataan to altogether, that mean you need to use add or subtract. Tambah ke nak tolak? Kita guna operasi tambah 23 plus 9 equals to Ni kita panggil number sentence Ayat matematik Awak tak tahu jawapan kat sini tak apa Sebab awak kena tunjuk jalan kira kat sini You need to show your calculation here Okay 23 plus 9 Please remember to add the ones first 3 plus 9 equal to Okay, uh, 12. Okay, number 2 here. Then number 1 is at the top. Okay, like this. 1 plus 2 equals to 3. So, your answer is 32. Don't forget to write down your answer in the box here. And also complete your number sentence. There are 32 stamps all together. Okay, question number two. Amin has nine postcards. Just Noor has nine postcards too. Find the total number of postcards. Okay, look at the word total here. Okay, still remember the keywords. Total means you need to do the addition process. Total, jumlah. Okay, write down. How many postcards does Amin has? Okay, write down. Nine postcards. How about just no? Just no also has nine postcard. Okay, how to write down your number sentence? Okay, very good. Nine plus nine equals two. Okay, don't know the answer is okay. Never mind. You can show your calculation here. Nine plus nine. Nine in your head. Another nine at your finger. So nine. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. So the answer is 18. The total number of postcard is 18. Don't forget to complete your number sentence here. Write down the same answer. Okay, done. Question number two. Very easy. We look at question number three. Nisa read eight story cards. Her brother read ten story cards. Calculate the difference of the story card. Look at the word different. Ah, different. Still remember the words? It's the keyword for addition or keyword for subtraction. Yes, different means beza. You need to do the subtraction to find the difference between Nisa and her brother. Okay, write down the answer here. Write down the, the number. How many story cards that Nisa read? Eight. Okay. Uh, how about the brother? How many? 
10 story card. So, different means you need to do the subtraction. How to write down your number sentence? Please remember, when we do subtraction, the bigger number must be in front. You cannot write 8 minus 10. It's wrong. The correct one is 10 minus 8. Bigger number minus small number. Okay. Show your calculation here. 10 minus 8. Okay. 10 fingers. Close 8 fingers. So how many left? How many fingers that you left? Okay. Write your answer in the box. The difference of the story card is 2. Okay. Look at question 4. There are 35 mangoes. 12 mangoes have ripened. How many mangoes that has not ripened? Okay. What's the story mean? Macam mana ni? Okay. Ada 35 biji mangga. 12 mangga dah masak. Have ripened. Dia dah masak. How many mangoes that has not ripened? Kita nak cari baki yang belum masak. So, we need to use... Or, uh, we need to use the subtraction. Okay, fill in the information here. Fill in the number. How many numbers of mangoes? 35. There are 35. Number of mangoes ripened. How many? 12. So, to find the mangoes that has not ripened, kita nak cari mangga yang belum masak, we need to use the subtraction. Okay, the bigger number in front, 35 minus 12. Okay, show your calculation. Okay, 35 minus 12. Please do the ones, please value first. 5 minus 2 equals to 3. 3 minus 1 equals to 2. So... There are 23 mangoes that have not ripened. Okay. Complete your number sentence here. 35 minus 12 equals to 22, uh, 23. Okay. Done. Question number 4. We continue on question 5. There are 14 potato curry puff. And 12 meat curry puff. Calculate the total number of curry puff. Okay, look at the words here. Total. Total means jumlah. You need to use addition or subtraction. Yes, very good. You need to use the addition. Write down your number sentence. 14 plus 12 equals to... Show your calculation in the space here. 14 plus add 12. Okay, do the ones first. 4 plus 2 equals to 6. 1 plus 1 equals to 2. So, the number total, the total number of curry puff is 26. Okay. Question number 6. The table shows the number of people in class 1 tekun. Boy, we got 16 boy. Girl, 29, 21. Okay, there are 16 boys and 21 girl. Calculate the total number of people. Okay, look at this word. Total. Total means jumlah. So, you need to do addition. Write down your number sentence. 16 plus 21 equals to, do your calculation, 16 plus 21. Add the ones, this value, 6 plus 1 equals to 7. 1 
plus 3, 1 plus 2, sorry, 1 plus 2 equals to 3. So, the total number, jumlah kesemuanya. The total number of people is 37. We proceed to question number 7. Li Qing has 46 picture cards. She gives 17 picture cards to Jasni. How many picture cards left? Okay, look, look at the words here. Left. How many left? Left means berapa yang tinggal. Okay, awak ada 46, uh, Li Qing ada 46 picture cards. Dia bagi dekat Jasni. Kita kalau kita bagi ke orang, makin banyak ke makin sikit yang tinggal? Makin sikit. Okey. So, bila makin sikit, ada perkataan left. We need to do subtraction. Kita kena buat operasi tolak. Awak nak tolak yang mana ni? 46 kat depan ke 17 kat depan? Ah, Please remember... The bigger number must be in front. 46 minus 17 equals to... Uh, okay, show your calculation. Okay, 46 minus 17. 6 minus 7. Boleh tak ni? 6 tolak 7. 6 kecil, 7 besar. Awak nak tolak? Tak cukup. Pinjam dekat tens. Pinjam berapa? Pinjam satu tens. Bila awak pinjam satu, nombor empat akan tinggal tiga. One tens equals to ten. Ten and six. So, the total is sixteen. Now, you can minus. Sixteen minus seven. Okay, sixteen minus seven equals to nine. Now, 3 minus 1. 3 minus 1 equals to 2. So, you get the answer already. There are 29 picture cards left. Ada 29 uh, card gambar yang tinggal. Last question for this lesson. Question number 8. There are 75 paper clips. Dayang, take away. 47 paper clips. How many, how many paper clips left? Okay, we got two words here. Two keywords here. Take away and left. Okay, still remember this word. Uh, this word is the keyword for addition or subtraction. Takes away. Ambil. Bila orang ambil barang, mesti lagi kurang kan? Ha. Okay, Dayang takes away 47 paper clips. How many paper clips left? Okay, so we do subtraction. 75 minus 47. Show the calculation here. 75 minus 47. Okay, do the ones first. 5 minus 7. Okay, we can minus... Uh, 5 and 7. Why? Because 5 is small. 7 is big. So, ask from the 7s here. From the 10s. Only ask 1 tenth. Okay, from 7. Now, the number is 6. Ada 7. Dah pinjam 1, tinggal 6. Okay, awak pinjam 1 tenth tadi. 1 tenth equals to 10. 10 and 5 is 15. Now, you can subtract. 15 minus 7. Okay, what's your answer? Okay, 8. Now, 6 minus 4 equals to 2. So, there are 28 paper clips left. Okay. Don't forget to write your answer in the box here. Okay. That's all for today. Thank you for watching.
Don't forget to complete your works on page 111 until 114. Okay, have a nice day. Goodbye.